Health Minister Chitalu Chilufia has warned against underrating the COVID-19 pandemic. Dr. Chilufia says Zambia needs to remain alert and monitor the progression of the pandemic. In speaking during the COVID-19 routine updates, the Health Minister announced that the country has recorded seven new positive cases and two recoveries in the last 24 hours. Sharon Kunda now reports. It is now one month and two weeks since the first two cases of the COVID-19 were reported in Zambia. The country has so far recorded high recovery and low mortality rates. Health Minister Chitalu Chilufia has attributed this to the various interventions carried out by the multi-sectoral team. He said this when he gave the latest figures on the COVID-19 during the routine updates in Lusaka. In the last 24 hours, we conducted 849 tests, out of which seven were positive. This therefore brings the cumulative number of cases to 153, with four deaths. We also discharged two patients, increasing the number of discharges to 103. Dr. Chilufia has called on citizens not to underrate the COVID-19. The countries where we've seen this flare-up had similar figures in the first few days. But just three months down the line, we're speaking of millions of cases and thousands of deaths. So we cannot underrate COVID-19 today. He has further advised the public to be extra cautious as the court season sets in. We should be very cautious and remember that the people who are at highest risk are those who are immunocompromised. And with the court season, an immunocompromised you know, status. And Information and Broadcasting Services Minister Dora Celia has equally urged citizens not to be complacent in adhering to instituted measures. The measures that we've given out, including not shaking hands, hand washing, wearing masks, social distancing, this is the behavior change we were looking for. And we believe that a lot of families now are at that point of behavior change. The first Stakeholders have continued showing solidarity to government. These include the common market for Eastern and Southern Africa and the Israeli government. Uh, we have developed guidelines to support Association of movements of goods during this pandemic. I also wish to report to you that I have been given a mandate by Jerusalem to be able to keep a watchful eye on the events in Zion and report the needs as they come. Sharon Kunda, ZNBC News, Lusaka. Remember to hit the like button, place a comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.